Guys, today I'm going to show you guys, like you see in the title, uh, how to bring a sample in the reason. And once you bring that sample in, I'm going to show you how to do this. You're going to chop that sample up and have it on four different keys going like this. And time Second key. Well, this is the first key. Sorry about that. First key. And time Second key. Away. Third key. No, no. Fourth key. Yeah, no, no. And this is pretty simple, man. Um, it's a lot of ways to do this, but this is just the one way I do it. So let's jump right into it. You're going to go over here. You're going to create a new instrument. I use the NNXT sampler. Your NNXT sampler, if it doesn't come in blank right here, go over here to edit on a PC, file on a Mac, and make sure this is unchecked. Load default sound into new device, and it'll, it'll load up blank. If not, you can right click and you can go in here and click uh, where it says, it should say reset. It'll say reset over here, right here, there you go. Reset device, and that'll clear out the preloaded sample that you have in. Next, you're going to bring in your sample. Mine is going to be on the desktop. I'm going to bring in Miss Holloway. I'm going to right click, edit sample. I'm going to take out some of this dead space at the beginning. Click save. Once I click save, I'm going to right click. I'm going to duplicate. First of all, once you load the sample up, you can, you ready, really. And this sample is going all the way through the keyboard. It's doing the same thing all the way through. Enter, 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 enter. Okay, so you might not want that. So you, what you'll do is uh, you'll right click. Duplicate zones, hold shift, click the other zone again, right click, duplicate that zone. And then depending on what I'm doing, I might sample, uh, I might have a sample broke down in eight different pieces. And then we're gonna, this is where the magic part comes in. You're gonna, you're gonna right, uh, you're gonna right click, gonna select them all, right click, auto map zones chromatically. And as you can see, is now broken this up into four different little pieces. It went from this to this. So let's click on that second note and let's uh, go to the start point right here and we're just gonna change that to something different. Let's put that on 10. Let's click on this, change that. Let's put that on 16. Let's click on the last key and put that on, I don't know, let's, Twelve. Who cares, right? So now, when I and so this is, should be the first key up here. And time Second key. Now you don't have to click on this to make it do it. I'm just clicking on it so you guys can see what I'm what I'm working with now and what key I'm touching. So now this is the key. I'm doing that. The next key here. It's doing this. <laughs> And now we. So first key, second, third, fourth, and that's simple as that, man. That's how you uh can bring a sample in and chop it up. That's one way to do it. It's not the only way to do it. Like I said, that's how I do it. If this video helped you out, please smash that like button. Make sure you subscribe. Uh, you guys like videos like this, man. If this helping y'all out, man, definitely let me know. And um, also leave me a comment. Let me know how you guys sample. Uh, do you guys use record players? You guys using an NPC? Y'all using uh, Fruity Loops? Uh, let me know what you guys working with and how you using it. And um, make sure you uh, like, comment, subscribe, smash that notification button to get more videos like this. Peace.